Sarah, what is hormonal health and why is it so important for women? Yeah, hormone health, really, hormones are little chemical messengers and they send signals around the body to all of our cells. So they're really important. When they're not in balance, little things can happen like our energy can dip, maybe skin outbreaks. We can get that fluctuation and, and imbalance in our hormones. So really, when our hormones are in sync, our body thrives. And what part does nutrition play in our hormonal health? Nutrition is a key role. It provides the raw ingredients really to make these hormones. So they're really important. When we're not getting these raw ingredients to make the hormones, we really can get these fluctuations and symptoms that, that are associated with them. So really the key is really good quality oils, B vitamins, vitamin D, these nutrients in our basic, really healthy, colorful diet that will, will help feed into healthy hormones. And we will just feel really, really good in ourselves. Does our hormone health affect our skin and our energy levels? Skin, I suppose, is the first, the outward reflection that we know something's going on in our system, that we, we have a little imbalance and we need to, to look at that and correct it. Vitamin B2 in particular, the riboflavin that you will find in your meats, in greens, particularly broccoli, your sprouts, um, eggs, would be a really important one to help maintain healthy skin and these nutrients, the vitamin B1, B2 and 6 that's found in clean marine for women are really important to help maintain energy yielding metabolism, which is very helpful in our body. As a nutritional therapist, what is your key advice for maintaining our best hormone health? Find out more. And there's really good information in the Essential Guide to Female Hormones that you can get in all your health food shops and pharmacies or download it online. And it's got great information, all the different nutrition stages that are tailored for each age group and what their needs will be.